from her. Uh. Just some of them uh, ask me where me get it from her. Uh. I told them no, no, it's from Queen Channel. I told them no, no, it's all from Queen Channel. Bam, bam, hey yo, what a bam. What's up everybody, this is All Things Beer 510, and today we bringing you a review from Alvarado Street Brewing, this is Cool Runoffs. Cool Runoffs is at 8.1% double IPA from Alvarado Street Brewing, one of my favorite breweries from the Bay, from Salinas, has a brew pub in uh, Monterey. Um, they're pumping out a lot of great IPAs, and you know they're kind of picking up a buzz as one of the top places in the Bay Area, in Northern California, for IPAs. You have Temescal, you have Cellar Maker, you have Faction, um, you have uh, Fieldwork. Um, you know, of course, you have the you know the Russian Rivers, and um, you know Hen House is some uh, a new brewery, Moonraker, Track Seven. It's so many great breweries in in the Bay Area. But Alvarado is picking up steam. A lot of their IPAs contains no juice. Uh, is you know very very popular around here. Their Mai Tai uh, PA is very popular, um, and they and they they're always bringing out beer to the East Bay to the Bay Area. This is no different. Dope can work. They probably have maybe the dopest can work with uh, in the Bay Area next to field work. I send a lot of this beer off to all my people's nerd scents. Uh, reviews back east they, you know they like it a couple of my friends they really like this beer not this beer in particular but just Alvarado Street um, they're becoming really one of my favorites um, for IPAs uh, contains no juice right now is probably my favorite offering from them I did not review that that came out before I started doing reviews um, but I have um, reviewed Vengeful Barbarian and a couple other uh, collab beers with, that they've done. So Electric Lettuce was from them and Moonraker. Um, also the Cryo um, beer with um, Cellar Maker um, was also, um, when Dove's Cryo was also a collab with them. So enough of the talking. Let's get it open, see what it smells like, see what it tastes like, and tell you what I think. This was canned 820, 820. It was it was came six twenty so a couple days ago um, yeah so they said it was supposed to be a West Coast IPA that turned out into the East Coast IPA maybe because it turned out hazy I really don't know uh, the hops is not on this beer maybe some Simcoe maybe some Eldorado um, you know some Citra beers like that as you see um, very beautiful and this smells wonderful this is a wonderful smelling beer let's get up close and personal. Mm. Has oh, it has a soft flower strawberry peach smell. This beer smells just like peaches, some strawberries, some flowers, like you know, fresh roses. Yeah, this this beer it, it reminds me of like a starburst or you know a sweet sweet candy, but a lot of peach flavor, a lot of peach flavor. This you know this beer smells like you sliced a pe peach in half. And put it in a blender, put it with some beer. I mean, this is a peach smoothie. Let's get a taste. Cheers. Wow. Wow, 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 wow. Um, first off the bat, this is my favorite Alvarado Street beer. Guys, um, I'm saving the cans for me. I don't even know if cans are available. Kind of, I love Contains No Juice. That was like... A real dope beer from them when they first came on the scene. This is like peaches, apricots, mangoes, big tropical fruits, big starburst flavor. Has um, you know, yeah, big big tropical fruits. Um, has a little bit of bitterness to it. Um, but it's not a West Coast IPO IPA at all. This is just like a you know a smoothie. Um, I would I would probably say maybe some El Dorado. Um, this beer is hopped with maybe Citra, but I, I I'm, I'm not sure. But El Dorado um, maybe um, and then but yeah, just real big um, maybe Mosaic in uh, is in this beer. Yeah, I might be wrong, but I'm tasting Mosaic as well. Um, th this is a peach smoothie a peach 
shake. I mean, the mouth feels wonderful. Um, little to no bitterness at all. Um, goes down easy. 8.1. This beer will get you in trouble. This is my best beer that I've had from Alvarado Street. Um, I should have got more. Um, cool runoffs. Dope can. Great beer. Um, this will probably get a 4.75 for me on untapped um but then again i gave contains no juice a five and i like this better than contains no juice alvarado street whatever you're doing keep doing it make this beer again please 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 um i think they're gonna be at the festival of dankness um the modern times festival and i've been seeing them little by little just picking up steam um, with all these festivals they're doing and, and getting their name out there. And they're just really doing great IPAs. Um, just another great barrier brewery. We're lucky right now to be in the Bay. Um, yeah. Um, yeah. Great beer. Peaches, apricots, starburst, tropical fruit. That's what this beer is. Um, enough of the talking. Till next time. You guys take care. 100. Peace and love.